today I'm back with another wonderful wig. This one is by My First Wig and it literally was my first human hair wig. And I went through a bit of uh, a struggle to figure out how to get this wig done. Uh, I had never ordered from the My First Wig website before and all those categories about length, density, color, as in the picture or not in the picture, it was all very confusing. So they first made this as a black wig or a dark brown wig and it really looked good but it wasn't what I wanted. So <laughs> instead of saving that wig for someone else or selling it to someone else, I think they then proceeded to bleach that black wig into this color that you see here. And you know what happens when you do all of that treatment on hair, it just becomes um, damaged. So when it came, it looked very good. It was the color that I wanted, but because I had asked them to add a procedure, which I thought I had ordered originally, um, it cost more, and I think the hair quality suffered from all of those treatments. But the lace is extremely good. It always melted straight into my head. The wig fit perfectly. Um, it has a band which holds it in place. And uh, what else can I say? When you put it on your head, you don't need to do any of that baby hair and stuff like that. It really looks good. Like right now, all I used was this, which I learned from Miss Precious Marie, this balm lace putty. And it's very good if I'm not gonna run around and perspire or stuff like that, just to do a quick application. Um, I used a little bit of hairspray hair because it wasn't sticking. Um, and that's probably because I used some oil on my scalp before and perhaps it's too close to the hairline. But I also, because this hair is sometimes very dry and, you know, I, I, I styled it straight this time, but again, I like it a little bit curly and with bounce and body, but uh, I just left it like this for today. And these are the drops I found, not from a wig person, JVN drops. I don't know if you've seen it before. But um, they're moisturizing and they make the hair look really shiny. So that's what I added to give it a little bit of pizzazz. I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but anyways. So that's my hair for today. I wanted to show these beautiful coral earrings as well by one of my friends who's another jewelry designer. Uh, her company is called Shipwreck Montauk and she does a lot of marine themed jewelry which in the summer is uh, very beautiful. And as you can see, I'm just home today, so I wore my Hawaiian vintage dress. It's not summer at all in New York, but it uh, makes me feel like I'm traveling somewhere warm, which hopefully I will soon. And if we ever get up to 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours, I'll definitely take you there with me with some live um, coverage. Anyways, I think that's it for today. I don't really have much else to say about this, um, my first wig. It was uh, very satisfying uh, to get it in the color that I wanted. It looked extremely good. I felt extremely comfortable and confident when I was wearing it. I would definitely buy another wig from them, even though it, you know it's super expensive. It's really super expensive, but they do a good job. And I forget what company it's part of, but it's part of a bigger company that, you know, they're just killing it in terms of uh, human hair wigs and selling to, I, I guess, uh, the African-American population or whatever population in America. Of course, they're out of China, so, you know, well, deal with that. I like to support uh, the African-American uh, wig companies, but sometimes they get it out of China too. They're not all made here in the USA. But anyways, uh, it looks good and this is the back. Most times I wear it with the middle part, but sometimes I wear it with the side part. Very rarely do I wear it with the side part. But the only thing about the middle part is then sometimes you see the lace and you know there are many ways you can disguise that. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this short but sweet um, wig video. And please like and subscribe to support the channel and hopefully soon we'll be doing much more exciting things here. I have a bunch of other wigs lined up, uh, both synthetic and human hair wigs. Uh, over the next few weeks, I'll be posting a lot more with my bright professional lights and my professional camera setup. I hope you enjoy it. I, today, I'm going to take a break from the art thing because I'm a bit arted out, but I posted something in the shorts earlier. You can take a look at that and um, hopefully I'll see you again here another time as a subscriber. Thank you. Have a great weekend.